As Ellis Park, the match only got going with 15 minutes left on the clock. Robbins leading 12-6 got their first try through some clever work by Chester Williams. The Springbok winger took a quick throw, received the ball again and scored to take it to 17-6. With a nine-point margin, the match was all but won. But Transvaal launched yet another Houdini act and after several surges at the province line, right-wing Yakulo went over. Magic Gavin Johnson got two penalties in succession and a draw seemed the likely result. The words give up don't exist in the Transvaal vocabulary. A mistaken injury time by Western Province ended the match in dramatic fashion. Referee Rudy May, whose performance is all but convincing, ruled that Johnson got knocked off the ball and awarded the penalty try. The Ellis Park faithful invaded the pitch delirious with delight and it took several minutes before Johnson could take the conversion. The province players were not happy with the decision, which will go down in history as the critical moment in the 1994 Curry Cup season. All Transvaal need to do now is beat Eastern Province next week, and they will defend their Curry Cup title against Free State on October the 1st at Ellis Park. Johnson's conversion over, and that'll be.